So I was not the typical student at all. I was 30 years old with two children aged two and three and a full-time job as a paralegal. So I did my law degree part-time based on evening study um, and just to make life even more simple for myself, I had a third baby just after I sat my final exams in the fourth year. So I would say I was atypical in the sense that I was a parent, I was a mature student, but also, as is the case with many mature students from a very working class background. I was born in Cadiz, in the south of Spain, a wonderful place. And I was born to a wonderful family. Uh, I have excellent, fantastic parents. They didn't go to university. My grandparents didn't go to university either. I am the first uh, generation that went to university in my family. I was one of six children and I was number four out of six and my three older siblings all left school at 16 when you could leave school at 16. But my sister married a university lecturer and um, as I was going through school and I was performing well, you know, I was quite bright at school, they recognised that they thought I had the potential to go further so they encouraged me to stay on and do A-levels which I did and then they encouraged me to apply for university. So I applied for university not because anybody else in my family had done this, they hadn't, but because I was given encouragement by somebody who knew about university, you know, and yeah, the rest is history. The School of Social Sciences is a, um, is a big place. Uh, we are uh, one of the largest school of art of this type in Europe, but at the same time, it is a school that uh, still maintains a sense of uh, 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 intimacy that uh, our colleagues interact with each other in a good uh, uh, collegial way. But more importantly than that, we feel that uh, our students are here to teach us as much as we are here to teach them. So uh, learning from other people's point of view, learning about other people's uh, uh, experience in a school with so much diversity among staff and among our students is really a sense of uh, uh, a source of uh, a tremendous wealth. What I really like and or rather enjoy is the diversity of the community, uh, not just uh, the students who come from all parts of the world, but also the, the fraternity of uh, the academic staff is also very diverse in terms of their cultural background, their racial identity or their faith, whatever they follow. So that makes me feel uh, belong, belonging to this community. Um, yeah, that's what I really like. I think my favorite thing there is actually the collegiality of uh, college. College are very colleague, collegial. Um, they help each other, they help out e each other. And having led the department through the pandemic, I think it's been really, really good to see how colleagues have actually extended their hands, extended uh, hands to help, uh, help us, you know, help out. So I think that's one thing I would say is really good about the department. And also, of course, we have uh, in, this in, in, the, in law, we also have amazing students, I would say. I would say that the University of Manchester um, is the first place um, for um, excellence. It's a university where um, the staff um, believe in your capabilities even more than you believe in yourself. And this, um, of course, um, is a propelling factor for one to succeed in life. It will open your chances, your life chances. It will give you opportunities to go into all nature of careers that you might not even know about. And really importantly, um, you will get the support that you need. I think once you are in a university, you can deepen your knowledge, deepen your understanding, but also you will have the opportunity to get to know people from all across the UK, but also all across Europe and the world. It's really a, a fascinating reality. There's a thing called imposter syndrome, where people feel as if they're somewhere that they shouldn't be. I suffered massively, massively from that. I, I literally walked into a lecture theatre on my first evening and thought, what am I doing here? So if you're from a particular background and you think that, just get over your fear and do it anyway, because that's what develops you. I am the School of Social Sciences. 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 I am the School of Social Sciences.